my hand is like can cover the whole thing. You know, I also love the buy American stick. All right, so there was a young lady that told me she got a Mr. Copy Jr. from a, a thrift store. Shout out to her because watch my other videos. She said it helped her out a lot. And then someone just commented last night saying that they got a Mr. Coffee and that, you know, it's just it's a little passion thing on the side. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we all drink coffee here. Does your big 12 cup coffee maker make more coffee than you need? Then get the new mini drip coffee maker from Hamilton Beach. The mini drip is designed to brew two to four cups of coffee fast. Every cup hot, fresh brewed and delicious, not warmed over. Want another cup or two? It's yours in less than three minutes without one drop of waste. So stop pouring coffee and energy down the drain. Get the new mini drip, a great gift, only from the Hamilton Beach Scoville World of Appliances. Yeah, I'd like to place an order for a Hamilton Beach mini drip, please. First, it was the Hamilton Beach mini drip. Then came along the Mr. Coffee Jr. And now, it's the Hamilton Beach coffee maker mini drip. Guys, I honestly need an intervention. I have a problem here. I like collecting little miniature coffee makers. See, pretty small, right? Long time ago, I was searching for a mini coffee maker because I remember my mom used to have one and she gave it away. So, I found this and I said, wait a minute, what is this? I want that too. Then I said, wait, I want that. So this one I saw first, but it's kind of ugly. It's like a chocolate brown. And so I got this. Now these ones are very hard to find now. I guess people bought all the white ones. Um, these are relatively not too hard to find, but they are expensive, especially if it's with a box. And these ones, there's a lot of these, but they're they're gonna probably sell out soon on eBay or whatever website you like to go to. So, yeah, I have a problem, guys. I'm addicted. I'm addicted, but I love these things, you know. And the reason why I like having these three different ones is because they're all old 1970s 1970s and I think 1980s so I want to be able to use them interchangeably because they are old and I don't want to use the same ones every single day you know want to give them a nice little rest cool cool look at that coffee maker it's a four cup so yeah like I said man I love these mini small coffee makers Oh, what is this? Dude, you guys, I mean, honestly, guys, this came in clutch, bruh. Limited one-year warranty. That is so, I'm going to use that. I'm, I'm going to use that. Okay. So this thing is over 30 years old. All of these little mini coffee makers are over 30 years old. Vintage. There. Another one of these. Order original accessories. I'm ordering from here, dude. Definitely. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm I'm calling this number. I'm I'm definitely gonna order from that catalog. What is this? Market research department. Oh oh yeah, definitely. Alright, let's check it out guys. Pretty, pretty nice, pretty nice. Ta -da. This is it. Yeah, that's right. Buy American mother truckers. So this is it guys, it's very small, very cute. It's like a chocolate brown. Um, I've had my eye on this one for a while, but I definitely wanted the white one first. And that's a good thing. I bought the white one because now they are rare. I mean, 
how much smaller can I get? How much smaller? This is by far the smallest one out of these three. But what's funny is these are actually probably the same size. So what you can do is take that off and it looks identical. See? Both has a little thing on top. It still looks a little smaller, right? And you could take this off. It's like interchangeable parts, basically, right? So. Whatever. Obviously, the one on the right, the white one, looks clean. It looks nice. And this one here with the sticker on it doesn't look as nice, but you know, it, it has grown on me by looking at it because it's just got a cozy vibe to it. I like the the chocolate brown. That's, that's why I like this one too, because it has like a cozy. So the difference between Mr. Coffee Jr. and this is that all you do here, pull that out, you got your filter, you put your uh, coffee in there, Boom, ready to go. This one here, these two are basically identical. Is you gotta pull this out. You gotta open this. Put your filter inside here, right? Which I'll show you later. Put the cap back on. Boom. Then put the water in there. So basically, you have to clean a lot more parts. This one, you only really have to clean the carafe and this. This one, you have to clean the carafe, this, this, so. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. So this one here does not have a power button. It's just, I think you plug it in and it's just gonna be on when you plug it in and then to turn it off, you unplug it. Let's go ahead and try it out. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and make one cup of coffee. So basically what I like to do is Typically, one, two tablespoons, and I like to do almost a third tablespoon, right? So it's going to be like a little over two and a half tablespoons of coffee grounds, and these are the Starbucks Pike Place coffee grounds, right? go smells good already okay now we're gonna put this back on what I like to do is I like to take my handy dandy favorite cup and I'm not sure exactly how many ounces or how much of a close it is to a cup, but I just fill her up to about right there. Okay. Now let's go ahead and see how much that is and see how off I am or if I'm on the money. Oh, so it's a little more than a cup, so. Go ahead and fill the water reservoir up with one cup of water. Close it. Now, let's plug it in.
people, I think that is it. Let's go ahead and unplug it. Okay, so I just unplugged it. It is, I'm gonna let it sit for about 15 seconds and what I like to do is give it a little tap so that water kind of goes down. Also, what I like to do is take the filter, okay, like that, and squeeze. It's very hot, so be careful not to, you know, you don't want to burn your fingers, but I like to squeeze all the freaking rest of the coffee out and toss in the garbage. Also, all that as well. You guys know my love, my love for this mug. Whoa, whoa, that's, that's a good sign, guys. That means the coffee is hot. You see the steam coming up? Pretty hot, guys. It's, it's not too hot. You know, and this here, this little plate. Ooh, that's pretty hot as well. So yeah, guys, I mean, like I said, the reason why I like getting these is, number one, I really like how they look. They're very tiny. Two, I like coffee just straight up black like this, you know? No milk, no creamer, no sugar. And, uh, you know, takes up a little space you know we live in this apartment there's not a lot of space so what I do is I stash these up in that little area up there and they fit perfectly this thing used to be fourteen dollars and ninety seven cents at Gemco and I got it for twenty eight bucks what the fuck man cheers to all my coffee drinkers out there go ahead and give it a try Ooh, that's pretty damn good. Um, it's not as hot as I'd say the Mr. Coffee Jr. And probably not as hot as the other Hamilton Beach that I have. But what I typically do anyways is I microwave the coffee after. But yeah, that is damn good. It's just... It does the job, nothing fancy. I love the size of it. You know, it's tiny. My hand is like, can cover the whole thing. You know, I also love the Buy American sticker. So yeah, man, I mean, when I first started looking at the mini coffee makers, this one was always popping up on eBay. And I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. I want the other one though, which was the white one because it reminded me of the one my mom had. So I got that one and luckily I did because now they're going out. I mean, they're like selling out of those. So I bought the Mr. Coffee Jr. one after that and I was like, you know what? Let me get one of these. I mean, am I going to find a coffee maker that, you know, a drip coffee maker that's like this big? Who knows? Maybe instead of a four cup, it'll be a two cup coffee maker or a one cup. That would be cool. Maybe I'll look for one of those, like a super tiny little coffee maker though. I don't know. But yeah, guys, I mean, would I recommend this one? I don't know. I like it because of how small it is and it gets the job done you know easy to use you know all right guys thank you all so much to everybody all right so there was a young lady that 
told me she got a Mr. Coffee Jr. from a, a place, like a thrift store. Shout out to her because she got it on the, she, you know, she watched my other videos. She said it helped her out a lot. And then someone just commented last night saying that they got a Mr. Coffee and that, you know, it's just it's a little passion thing on the side. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we all drink coffee here. Some of us like, I like this. All right, guys, so cheers. Thank you all so much for watching Demise Media. Peace.